Hello everyone, it's Tuesday, November 15th, International Cup Day, and this is Polo Now. Good morning everyone, I'm Isabel Flores and today is the day. The International Cup is here. Live coverage starts at 3 p.m. from the Santa Rita Polo Farm. USA's 12-goal team is led by 8-goaler Nick Roldan, America's second highest rated player, making his ninth appearance. Roldan will be joined by Grant Gansey, last year's MVP, making his seventh appearance, and at age 24, the second youngest member of the team. They will be joined by Jack McLean and Darren Tamplin. We caught up with the team ahead of the match. Excited. I mean, look, it's, it's always, you know, a cool experience to be able to represent your country. So, um, you know, excited to have the Swiss team here and we're hopefully, we're hopefully for a, a fun match and to have a little bit of fun. Thank you. It, it always feels special to represent the USA. Um, humble to get the opportunity and I just hope that I can keep uh, the streak alive. It's kind of a, a burden we face every year almost, but um, you know, it's, it's, it's definitely good to have a little pressure on our backs and, and it's good to be able to play here in, at home in November and playing for the U.S. is it's always a pleasure. Well, I'm nervous, but Mark uh, was generous enough to uh, allow me to play some of his horses, so I know I'll be well mounted. Um, I want to thank him for that. I mean, it's going to be difficult to, to um, replace him. He's a great player, but I'm going to do my best. Oh, it's great, man. So lucky to be here, feeling awesome, and uh, just super excited to get out there and, and get to it. Switzerland, a 13-goal rated team, has a formidable lineup with one goalers, Fabio and Luca Mier, five goaler, Thomas Ruiz Ganazu, a member of the 2022 Swiss international team, and six goaler, Sugar Erskine. Ganazu was a member of this year's team that competed in the 2022 FIP World Championships, and we spoke to them to see how they were feeling about today's match. It's very nice. It's the first time I'm playing here in uh, in the United States, especially representing my own country. Coming from Switzerland, it's uh, something which I think from a little boy you you, you want to make it, and uh, luckily I can. And uh, yeah, I'm very happy to be here and to represent Switzerland. Well, um, of course, we didn't play the last uh, one month or something like this in Switzerland because in Switzerland is uh, it's cold right now. And uh, of course, the others, they are trained better at the moment. But I think in Polo, if you have one, one game, it's enough to, to get into it and uh, to, to try uh, and uh, to, to train for, the, for tomorrow. So it's very good fun. It's very good fun to come here to Palm Beach uh, to represent Switzerland, of course. Uh, it's always a pleasure to represent the country. Uh, we play also in Chantilly in the place off for, for Switzerland and we are really, really happy to be here representing the country as well. Yeah. Uh, obviously, it'll be hard to play against the Americans, but uh, we're going to give it our best shot and uh, try and make Switzerland proud. USA is going for their 11th straight International Cup. You heard me right, they won 10 straight since 2012 in front of sellout crowds and a worldwide Chucker TV audience. Now get this, the US has beaten England, Chile, Mexico, South Africa, Uruguay, Brazil, Azerbaijan, France, and Argentina twice in the annual battle for the coveted cup. We'll see if Team USA has what it takes to win once again, or if Switzerland will finally dethrone the champs this afternoon. Make sure you're following CTV on all of our social media platforms to stay up to date on all the latest International Cup news. That will do it for this edition of Polo Now. Thank you very much for waking up with us and have a great day.